Greetings, my fellow hunters, and welcome again. Today, I think I'll be doing a different review. Instead of doing another anime, I thought of doing a TV show I recently watched and I kind of like. So today, we are going to be reviewing The Miraculous Adventures of Ladybug and Shot Noir. And as I always say, let the good hunt begin. So, my overall thoughts of this anime is pretty good, but I'm getting ahead of myself. So what's the story? The story follows the characters of Marinette Dupeng Che and Eugene Agrest, who are both Ladybug and Chat Noir, and yes, I'm going by the French pronunciation, not the English, because it was originally French. Sorry. Who must face the evils of Hawk Moth and stop him from accumatizing the people and using them as supervillains. So he's the super sort of villain who just sends other people to do his jobs, except he gives them superpowers and then hopes to get the miraculous for unknown reasons. As of the, this fit recording, there are reasons, but as for the spoiler, I'm not going to spoil anything because I'm that sort of hunter. And yes, that is the entire lead plot. Other characters are introduced later on, but just for the sakes of keeping things spoiler-free, I'm not going to review anything. And the fact that it's such a simple plot kind of makes it difficult to me express it. So, yeah, the plot is that, you know, he wants to get the miraculous, so he akumatizes people. Ladybug and Shot Noir stop him and save the day. It's a formula that I think we've seen in every other show. It does get a little stale over time, but then again, I kind of had to watch it and not take breaks. You know how I am. And, and switch speaking of characters... I like him, except one, but I'll get to her in a minute. Ladybug is, aka Maranen Dupeng Cheng, is a lovely character. She is a little shy, but has some confident moments in her, and she has to live a double life of being a superhero and being an ordinary girl. Kind of like Peter Parker, except instead of a spider, she's a ladybug. Hmm. But either way, she's a really good written character who's just cheerful to watch, and you just root for her. Her psych or friend, Adrienne Agrest, a.k.a. Chat Noir, is a son of a rich man who is a world-renowned fashion designer, and I thought Adrian would be the pompous rich kid who just has money and flaunts him about, but thankfully, he isn't that sort of person. Thank God, otherwise I'd be having a lot more to say. But he's a really simple character. He just wants to do good and just has a nice heart because his mother died or is gone. No one knows. And... He has to live with the fact that his father doesn't interact with him much. So he's kind of on his own most of the time. It's also quite sad, honestly. And then there is Chloe. She's of note one of the worst characters I've seen in quite a long time. Chloe is what we would call the spoiled brat. If Adrian was Chloe, I would have actually had more to complain about Adrian, but... Chloe is the main issue because she is that stereotypical rich daughter brat. She thinks because her father is the president of France that she can get away with anything, despite the fact that it shouldn't be possible because the French president should have more, what's the word I'm looking for it, standard than that. And doesn't affect her mother is horrible. She's just as bad as if not worse than Chloe, if that's even possible. Spoilers are wording. So, yeah. Chloe is actually one of the worst characters I've actually had the displeasure of, um, you know, saying. Mm, I'd say more, but frankly, I think that is enough to condense my opinions. We have also have Alia, Marinette's best friend, who is also the journalist. She tries to blog whatever Ladybug does. And I don't know how to feel about that. That's fine, but at the same time, it gets a little annoying because she's Ladybug-obsessed. But she's also pretty good friends with Marinette. So I think it cancels each other out. And she's an alright character. I would list some more, but there are so many to name. And I don't think I could list every single character in this video. So to simply crunch up my ideas, they're fine. They're not bad, not good. They're serviceable. Except Chloe. And as for the animation... I don't know. I'm a little torn beyond this one. I don't really like 3D animation that much because I grew up with 2D and I'm more nostalgic for that. So my eyes might be rose-tinted with 2D animation, but if I must give credit, it is very well done. It looks bright, it's colorful, the AI are expressive, and the animation at least doesn't look stiff like they're robots. At least it has some fluidity, which I can say 
for a TV show, that's pretty impressive. Not that saying that TV shows that use 3D animation is bad. It's just that it looks good, it's colorful, it's bright. Not really more I can express myself on that since there's only so much I can criticize with 3D. And as for the music, I'm torn. I love the opening, which I'll get to in a second, but the rest of the soundtrack is just reused over and over and over again. There's a little soundtrack to whenever Miraculous Ladybug, you know, when she just has that little jingle. It gets a little repetitive at times, but hey, it's a signify she's won. But as for the opening, it's pretty good. It's got a nice beat to it, and I really do love listening to it on my free time. Take that as you will. I would say something about the ending, but the ending cheats a little bit because it uses the same stock music as the opening, so no points there, and it's just a still image of them, of the two characters just spinning around between their costumes. But that's just my thoughts. Overall, I love it. It's a great show if you want your kids to just sit down with them or just watch it on your own. I don't judge. So, I'd say give it a watch. If you love it, great. If you don't, it's your opinion. Hang on, what time is it? Oh my goodness, it's that time. Forgive me, High Hunters, I have to go. But before I do that, like and subscribe if you want to. It appreciates me and it knows my channel's growing. Follow me on Twitter down below. My Discord will also be in the link. As I love talking to my people. Please come and join if you want to talk to me. That'll be fantastic. Thank you, my fellow hunters. And may the good luck guide your way. Oh. <sighs>